It's all right. You're in oh. hospital. Yeah. Leave that. It's helping you breathe. You're oh. not well. All right, you've got pneumonia. Just got to relax, OK? Hang on, hang on, hang on. Hi. Are you... I'm Jamie. I'm your grandson. Just rest, eh? You have a nice, relaxing bath and get into some fresh clothes. Okay. I won't be long, Granddad. Do you want me to get you anything? Any magazines, grapes, anything? Why don't you bring him some cordial? Something to cheer up the water. Right, OK, cordial. See you then. Bye. You're very lucky to have someone who cares so much. Why aren't you at work? I, I don't work anymore. I'm retired. Oh. Where's Dad? Have you and him had another round? It's Emily, Mr Baldwin. <laughs> what am I doing here, Mum? <laughs> These people... <laughs> they keep talking to me. Well, they're just... they're just concerned for you. You need to rest. You'll be fine. You promise? Oh, the, the doctor's here. Very good. You'll be back on your feet in no time. Well, where's Dad? He, he's coming along later. I mean... Business to run. And I have a job. You to lie here and get better, Mr Baldwin. I can't! Your business is being taken care of by your family. I haven't got a family. Mr Baldwin, if you don't behave, I'll have to sedate you. <coughs> you need to rest. It's the only way your body's going to get better. Why am I here? You're not well. It's my job to help you get better. Right? Now you rest. He cannot have just disappeared. He was fine when I left him. What's going on? Mike's legged it. He can't have. Well, I doubt if he's been kidnapped. Have you checked the toilets? Maybe he's in there. He's not in the toilets. The state he was in last night, he couldn't have even got through the door. Listen, I want someone in here now that knows what they're doing. I know what I'm doing. You have lost my dad. <laughs> hey, I need you to get back in the flat, love. Well, Mike's gone AWOL. Yes, he's disappeared, and we're running around like headless chickens looking for him. <coughs> Are you all right, love? Oh, go away! Are you all right? I say, go away and leave me alone! I want to go home. Mr Baldwin, please, you can't just go barging through the whole hospital. I know what you want me to do, love. You want me to go home, don't you, and wait for news. Well, I ain't going anywhere until I've found my old man. Got it? You're causing a disturbance. I'll cause more than a disturbance. Don't you worry about that. 
You got security cameras? Well, of course you've got security cameras, because I've seen them on the news when the nutters come in to steal the babies. Your father wasn't in the maternity unit. And that's supposed to be funny, is it, eh? You're not telling me this place ain't rigged up with CCTV. There are some Right, well, come on. I'm on the way and call the old Bill, because if anything happens to my old man, I'm holding you personally responsible. It's not my fault. Not your fault. Of course it's your fault. Mr Bob... Listen to me. My dad ain't well. You've had him wired up to machines all night, got it? He's confused and scared. You understand that, don't you? All I want to do is find my dad and look after him. of you. Factory's closed. Let's get you inside. I, I haven't got a key. I'll get you to my place. Get you room. Mike, you're meant to be in hospital. I always keep my keys in my pocket. Mike, you're in your pyjamas. Yeah, but... Oh. 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 You shouldn't be here. I'm calling an ambulance. Uh, yeah, ambulance, please. Dead him. Yeah, yes, go have an ambulance, please. Oh, quickly. You can make anything. Coronation Street, right, Weatherfield. No, yeah. no number. We're out on the street itself. It's a very tough fiber. Yeah, well, it's a friend of mine. He's meant to be in hospital, but Alma. I found him out here in his pajamas. Alma would be worried about me. Baldwin. What's My your Baldwin. phone? Phone Alma for me. It doesn't look too good if you could have it. Be... Thank you. She'll be in the calf. All oh, my feet are cold. Yeah, I had the keys in my pocket, of actually. Yeah, it was opposite, opposite the Rovers, but now it's gone. It's all right, Mike. It's no, it's right. not, it's gone! No, Mike, it was not down, Mike. This is your factory now. You own this factory. What are you doing here, Bon? Looking after you. I don't need... don't need anybody looking after me. Where's, where's Deirdre? She's at home. Oh. Yeah, but who's home? There's something I've got to tell you about me and Deirdre. I know. What? She told you? Mike, that was a long time ago. No, 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 no. No, she's going to leave you. She's going to come and live with me. She's going to get the kid, that, that, uh, Tracy, and she's going to come and live with me. You're finished, Barlow. Deirdre loves me. She's mine, I... Oh! oh. No. Oh. Mike! Oh. Mike! Oh. No, you don't, Baldwin! No! No, no you don't, Mike! Oh. Come on! Come on! Oh, no! No! We've been looking everywhere. He's dead. He can't be dead. dead. I think it was his heart. He can't be dead. Get off him. There's nothing you Just can do. Just get off him. Get off him. Mike. 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 Mike, listen, it's Dan. Mike. Come on, Mike. Dan? Michael, come on. <laughs> <laughs> 